Well, good morning, YouTube. Um, it's horrible in the UK today. We've got another storm, Storm Henry or something, coming uh, in from the east. So, today, uh, just a quick little job to do. Um, I've got a, a dash cam up there at the moment, uh, an ex-base one, which is going in the missus' car because hers went. And I've got myself a new one to put up, which is the uh, Vantrue N2. So I thought I'd just put uh, a quick video out there to show you me connecting up. Nothing special, but what I wanted to do is just quickly show you um, how I've wired it in. So obviously I don't want wires everywhere. Um, the wire goes into the headline in there and if you pull that down slightly you can feed the wire behind there. You pull this cover off just here and you can put the wire behind there and that literally just pops off so no biggie not going to do it now because it's been hard wired for ages but on the Audi you've got a fuse box just here and all you need to do is get yourself one of these little cigarette adapters I think you can see that there hope you can so it's just tucked up there little cigarette adapter um, because what happens is a lot of these um, dash cams are not 12 volts they are 5 and 6 volt um, so you get yourself one of these cigarette lighter adapters and I can just quickly splice that into the video you tape in your connector that goes into the cigarette lighter um, obviously earth it out with a good earth there and then you just find yourself a live connector like that so put yourself a spade connector on the end that will basically go in like that just plug in there and that obviously has to be one that comes on when you switch the ignition on any cheap multimeter you can find one of those with um, mine is right at the top there not sure what number it is but it's right at the top okay so literally quick video just about how I spliced it in hope it helps bye bye YouTube <laughs> 